better understand the condition called cystitis, we need a quick review of the anatomy. So here is a picture showing gallbladder, bile duct, stomach and the bile tube. And now we move to a second picture which shows gallstones which are not doing much, just sitting there and allowing bile to freely move in and out of the gallbladder. Acute cholecystitis is a complication of the gallbladder where a stone blocks the exit. So let's just draw that. That's a gallbladder. These are the stones. And one of these stones has now blocked the exit. The difference between acute cholecystitis and just biliary colic is that the stone just does not move. Uh, and there are other stones as well uh, in this diagram, but this one stone has caused an obstruction. It does not move for some time and that causes the thickness um, of the gallbladder wall to increase so that it becomes quite red and inflamed. Uh, and the fluid inside gets inflamed and sometimes gets infected. So the symptoms typically are unrelenting pain as opposed to pain that goes away. Uh, uh, after about half an hour to six hours. Sometimes patients may have temperature and sometimes they may vomit. This pain typically is uh, on the right side of the abdomen under the rib cage and it tends to go to the right side. So what do we do for this condition? Um, ideally the patient should have an operation um, but before that pain relief is required and sometimes antibiotics are given. Ultimately, as I said, the treatment is to remove the gallbladder by way of a laparoscopic cholecystectomy. And this can be done in this acute condition, acute cholecystitis, if the presentation is within three days. If it is longer than three days, then most surgeons would wait for up to six weeks and allow the gallbladder to cool off. Rarely, patients present with such severe symptoms that a tube has to be inserted into the gallbladder before the operation to drain out all of the pus uh, and to allow the gallbladder to cool off and for the infection to settle down. That is called a cholecystostomy. This is a temporary arrangement um, which is then removed uh, a few weeks later or at the time of the operation.